Stay tuned for urban legends to ghostly tales of the paranormal, because now it's time for Message on the Wall. This week's Message on the Wall brings you the story of Fosbury Camp. Today we should be thankful we no longer endure many of the diseases suffered in the past, which made for short lives, and nothing took more than the plague. The following story is set in 1665 in the small English village of Vernon Dean in Hampshire. The plague was already running wild in London, with those already infected trying to escape the fate of thousands, and the village came in contact with the plague. The only way to stop it spreading further was to isolate and quarantine any victims. The brave people of Vernum Dean agreed that they would move out of the village to a nearby ancient site on a hillside called Fosbury Camp. But with the plague being treatable, with the right nursing, those villagers that had been in contact with plague victims, and those who had the plague alike, only agreed to such a plan with the help of the village rector, who promised to supply them with food and drink. The rector took the provisions to the edge of the quarantine area, which worked well for a time, but then he began to fear for his own well-being. With preservation for his own skin taking over, he stopped taking the food, leaving those villagers who didn't die from the plague to be taken by starvation. The place is now said to be haunted, but not by those poor souls who were left to their own fate, but by the rector who haunts the ill, full of remorse for what he had done. It's said that he will continue to haunt Fosbury Camp, doomed to penitence for eternity. You have been listening to Message on the Wall, brought to you in association with Paranormal Parodies. You can find Paranormal Parodies at paranormal-parodies.com.